Hi, Mr. X with Glossary Term Multiplicative Inverse for Matrix. The inverse will be of a square matrix, and when we multiply a matrix times its inverse, the resultant is the identity matrix. Now, these examples just use letters. That's, uh, it's quite a little lesson, actually, to explain the process to do this. It's a little more than just a glossary term. But there are in general, a set of numbers, 3 by 3 matrix here would have 9 elements. This is what makes them square, is the same number of rows as columns, the same number of elements in each row as in each column makes it square. Then if this matrix is the inverse of this matrix, when we multiply them, we get the identity matrix, which is zeros everywhere except for the ones on the main diagonal. This is the identity matrix. Mr. X, Mentor of Mathematics at MrXMath.com